Yeah, hold on. I, I I am not willing to get out of my seat to stretch to plug this in. Come on. Okay, got it. You got you got a third dizzy today. Hey, nice. Oh, you're trying to get the artifact. Uh, rip then. At least you got three dizzies. That's something. Uh, that that imprint though. <laughs> Gotta flex those whale or free to play by the way muscles with the extra imprint bonuses. Hey Setzer, how are you doing? Yeah, I made a lot of good progress today in uh, in Epic Seven earlier. I can finally consistently auto run golem or golem eleven, so I don't have to bother doing that boss manually. Thank God. So now I've finally broken into that cycle where I can finally grind out Golem 11 to tank up my super tank for Wyvern 11. So then I can finally, uh, what was it? So I can auto uh, Wyvern 11 uh, after I tank up my General Purgus. And it's coming along all right, but the main problem right now is that I'm gonna need to find a defense set necklace. I'm just like, oh my god, those are gonna be rare as hell to find. So screw me. Uh. All right. Then. So we did the thing last stream where I was trying to fight the uh, Hedon boss again because I. Uh, Apparently killed it too quickly and didn't learn the uh, lore. Whoops. So had to spawn it again to learn the lore, and that took a while because I did not know that you had to feed the chest uh, X amount in one go. Because I thought you had to just give it, give the coral to the chest like whatever in total, not in one go. So then I was like, why? like, I gave it 50 million core, why isn't it letting me through? I was like, oh no, you need to give like 20 something in one go. I was like, oh, you goddamn. <sighs> to say the least, I was a little bit angry. But yeah, we finally got that done. <laughs> can check that off on the list of things I want to collect in the game. Even though I'm not necessarily going for like true perfectionist 100% or anything like that, uh, no, nah, I don't think I'll go as crazy as to do stuff like you know 100% learn everything with Gao, with Strago's lore. Uh, I'm not gonna go that far to 100%. Like I'll try to see if I can do as much content as I can do. But I don't think I'll tediously collect every last one because I do not want to go back to the belt. <laughs> I tried that the first time. We, we, we got a good amount of rages learned, but I'm just like, eh, you know, I, I don't want to do it anymore. Alright, at my weapon for you. I believe the Genji shield. I think the red cap was the one that increased HP. Yeah, it was impossible statistically. No, but statistically, uh, there is... There's a chance that, well, you will learn everything eventually. It's just, how long do you want to put up with, with the odds? That, that, that's the... That's the biggest thing. Also, what does Red Jacket do again? Houses, legendary grappler's spirit. Ah, oh, right, right. Immunity to fire. Yeah, sure. All right, and then there's Gogo, -Go, Magus Rod, best in slot. 
Okay, let me check something. Don't want Terra to be the one to nullify Mo- Actually... Ah, here it is. <clears throat> yeah, because I'm gonna need to give this to... To Edgar, since he won't get much magic block from these two, because we need the stat boosters feeding into Atma Weapon. So he'll take that one to kind of cover his bases. Now Genji Shield... Actually, can... Okay, okay, so... Gogo can take that. What if I just equip everything and see where it is? Hmm. Oh wait, no, uh, hold on. Let me check, what's the Genji Shield? Is it just pure stats again? Or is there more bonuses? Let me double check that. Okay, so it's basically meant for magic block and just raw defense. Meanwhile, the Aegis... Oh no, no, the Aegis is more for pure blocking. Oh no, no, Force was the elemental one. So, magic block, defense and block, and then Force was elemental. So I think, uh, actually, what did Force Armor do? Cause, uh, was there a special property of that one? Hey, Sira. Oh uh, yeah, Force Armor have elemental damage. So Celis can tank decently well with the Force Armor. Actually, wait, if she can deal with, if she can tank with the Force Armor. Then I can just do Genji Shield, because there's no elemental bonus to this, so we can just stack more magic. Let's see, circlet. Is it worth the extra stats? Yeah, sure. And then we can have the, the Aegis Shield. No, but the Aegis Shield is only meant for blocking attacks, not elemental defense. Actually, no, do, do I have this backwards? No, but Edgar might need it too, shouldn't he? Yeah, because he has no other way to really defend himself. Raw numbers... Actually, what did Circlet do? Was there like a special... Let's see, let's see... Circlet, here it is. So it's just there for some stat padding. Uh, I mean, Gogo doesn't really get any more stats. <laughs> So he kind of needs what he can get. Yeah, I think uh, this revision is probably better. Actually, let me check the Thunder Shield. Actually, yeah, Thunder is probably objectively better than Ice Shield, unless I just really want to defend Ice. Because Ice Shield. It provides... Yeah, it provides a weakness to wind, which can happen. Yeah, because we can absorb and half... Basically, we can nullify a lot of damage. These ones have weaknesses to them that I do not want to deal with, so... Actually, wait, if you equip two, two items that have certain, ele certain elements, do they stack in that it halves damage and then halves it again, or does it only apply that elemental defense once? So like only one applies, where it's like, oh, if you have two 50% resistances, does it only use one of the two? 
Alright, I really don't feel like testing that right now. <laughs> it's either... extra block or... Actually, even then, the Thunder Shield comes with... Uh... It comes with certain... Elemental, like, blocks or absorbs, though. Eh, yeah, actually, I think that'll cover my bases better. Okay, so we got the gem box for dual casting. And... Either I can go defensive... Or just double down on the damage with... Okay, technically not double, but... Put on the earrings for more damage. Quick search says they don't stack. Oh, that sucks. Oh, well. At least I can take advantage of what the Thunder Shield provides with absorbing and the uh, null effects. Alright, Admiral Weapon cannot be two-handed. Man. Oh, I mean... You can always, uh... Do the good old Hyper Wrist and... Atlas Armlet. I should probably test out the damage now, because I think 2k HP with that much vigor should be good. Also, what does Fairy Ring do again? Poison Dark. Okay, we don't need to worry about that. Probably put on Earring so magic damage doesn't scale poorly. And as for me or Gogo... Excuse me. Probably protects against Infant Mute. And give me the sneak ring until we get locked back. Actually, I wonder if I should put lock back in like the end game party or leave and go go. Hmm. Oh no, that's Thief Glove. Where's my sneak ring? Here it is. Actually, hmm. We could just leave on the XP egg for <clears throat> for go go, so that we can start racking up more levels to not take like 30 minutes to steal one item. So uh, yeah, I think that'll be the plan. And as for this again, we're still... actually, how's everyone's levels? 3k, 4k... so probably like two extra fights until we level. And in the meantime... oh no, we learned Flare. Now we just need to learn uh, holy. I, I mean, pearl. <laughs> Stamina is basically useless. Actually, what does Bahama give? Oh, 50% HP. Okay. Bismarck. Try talk. You're still learning, right? Yeah, yeah, you're still well anyway to learn. And unfortunately, we can't learn a single thing with... with Gogo. -Go. Oh yeah, by the way... Um... When you use... <clears throat> when it comes to learning lore, does it have to be with Strago in the party, or can Gogo -Go learn it if... You have lore in the menu, or is it just go go only? Uh, I assume. Yeah, uh, go go only. Uh, struggle only. Because uh, I assume it's struggle only, but. Ah, uh, struggle only? Uh, okay, okay. Because I don't really have much for lore in here, so there's no point then. Um, I can make him dance. <laughs> nah, the stats are pretty poor. Um, what should I do then? Hmm. It was all PT magic. Hmm. 
Oh wait, he knows all party members' magic. Oh, oh, wait, you mean... Oh yeah, because he can't learn... He, he can't equip Esper, so... He already knows everyone else's magic. Okay, thanks for clearing that up. Yeah, I guess uh, this would pretty much be the only... Real choice because well, throw and eh, tools, mm, not super great. Blitz. I mean, look at those stats now. Runic. I have to equip a sword. Lore. I need to learn more Strago, but I really don't feel like it. Sketch. Uh, I think I have to sketch the right monsters or something, but I feel like this is super underwhelming. Slot. Uh, I mean, it's kind of fun to play with the slots every now and then, but eh. Dance. I'd rather not put myself into a fixed state for the entire battle along with rage, so yeah, I guess magic's the only real choice. Alright, so after all that, let's go touch down on ground somewhere and then save, so we don't have to re-equip everything again. And then I have to wonder where the hell Locke is, because I remember... Do I have the Tau robe? Ah, uh, losing 6 speed kinda sucks. Yeah, I'd rather not lose speed, because... You, I'd rather take everything I can get when it comes to turn order. Because I'd rather have more turns than one better burst and take forever. Probably like, damage per turn wise it probably wouldn't turn out as well. I don't know. Boy, where's the town robe? I don't remember seeing it, or at least I don't remember what town it was in. Miranda? Oh, wait, which one was Miranda again? Oh, and no, Miranda was the one near the. Uh, the mountain, right? Yeah, because this was Nikaea. I really wish FF6 had an actual world map menu so I can see town by town what's what. They had it in FF4 and 5, come on. Although, wait, did the original FF4 have a world map thing? Actually, no, the mobile is over there. It, it was this one. That's how <laughs> Twelve hours later. Uh, that was Zozo. This was Miranda, right? Miranda is the southmost town? Oh. Oh, right, right, right. Southernmost, as in like south, southeast here. Oh no, no, this was the uh, Thamasa. This one, right? Potato memory. <laughs> God damn. On that other island. Oh, southmost over here, right? Okay, okay. So what was that robe again? Let me see. I have some spare money so I can afford to just check and even... <laughs> I'm not sure where it was either. 
Oh yeah, here it is. Also crystal mail. It's a downgrade for most people. Yeah, I'll just bottle in and see uh, what the comparison is. Ooh. Yeah, that is a tough call. The desert outside is the best level of magic? Oh. Hmm. I might consider doing that later. Not right now, though. Cactar. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, is the cactar spawn over there? Oh, god. Hmm. I mean... I wish I could see, like, a visual comparison of how fast you can fill the ATV from this speed and, like, the old reference speed. Hmm. Because Gogo really can use every stat he can get, but the trade-off... I don't know. Oh, well. Does the cactar have anything good to steal, by the way? Or is it just there for, uh, magic training? No permanent stat increasing items in this game. Yeah, it would have been nice to, to get some of those. Just so he's fun Chrono Trigger. <laughs> uh, how do you guys like to use your permanent stat items? Like, do you just stack it on one or maybe two characters to make them super godly, or do you just like spread it on all your party members? Oh, for a thousand needle or blowfish lore? Ah, uh, uh, too bad I don't have Strago in the party. No, oh, it's like the desert here. Wait, Cactrot? There's a certain character that's very. S hmm. <laughs> Hmm... Conversating? Yeah... How bad can this be? Oh, he just dies on that one hit. Holy shit! Oh my god, we're rich! Wow. Huh. I, th I thought it would actually be a challenge to to fight, but I mean, okay. Now, where was uh, where was it? Ah, oh, here, right, here it is. Preemptive ray steel is nothing good. Ah, okay. And uh, where's I hear his back guard? Okay, so we can go learn stuff real quick then. Then we can learn 
We can learn, uh, holy, the fire stuff. Soft gold meal. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, let's, we can also learn a Cure 3. Actually, no, 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 no. Let's learn uh, Haste and Slow 2. Yeah. So, can you only find Cactars around here? Well, I mean, I'll find out. Hey, Apache! Uber. Uh. Um, were you weak to ice? Did you have anything good to steal, sir? Oh. Hey. That's not fair. What do you do? What? What do you get three? So that also means I gotta run from the next one if I want to keep leveling uh, for Holy, because I'd need to switch out then. Well, I can switch Esper's mid battle. <laughs> I'm pretty broken, but. <laughs> Alright, so let's just keep doing this real quick so we can learn haste and slow to and holy. Building up something. Yeah, I don't want to level with this Usper equipped. No, thank you. Goodbye, sir. Have a nice day. I right, might as well try to equip the right Usper and kill it. But, uh... There we go. So you can't use magic against... <laughs> okay.
You think everything is like that, but the chainsaw... Oh, you're right, you're right. Huh. Guy then Hoovers. Oh my god. Okay, fine, fine. I'll switch the Esper so we can actually fight it. And then we find the Cactar next one. <laughs> okay, wait, now how close am I though? I know we only fought like two, three times at this point. Ah, okay, so we, we just need two more. We're gonna need three more. And two more fights. Okay, so basically three at most. Okay, okay, but first let's put this back on so we can actually kill the damn thing. Oh, you... <sighs> of course it puts it up the moment I switch. Okay, now I'm looking for the Hoover. Well... Desire Sense hit me again. I just need the Hoover fight for one level up. Okay, thank you. Oh, it's not even that strong, okay. Alright, and how far away is Disc from leveling now? Oh, just one more fight. Although, I guess we don't really need to worry about... Uh... Disc leveling. 
mainly just Terra. Because we're playing to learn... learn holy. And either way, if I find one Hoover fight and one Cactar fight, I think I should be done with everyone else's uh, levels. Or uh, spell learning or whatever. Also, I hope I haven't overstepped and... Yeah, I, I overstepped one time. Wow, it, it, it really takes a long time to run from these things. Oh my god, what, what's the level on these things? Oh no! Oh, thank god he blocked it. Oh nice! Learn ice... Or the tier 3 spells now. Okay, now that you learn the tier 3s... Now I can go learn Flare. And we're still learning... Uh, yeah, we just need one Cactar and we're done. Oh, wait, wait, I, I need to heal up. Unless we find another Hoover that ends up killing Gogo. <laughs> yeah, this this riding spot's pretty neat. The two enemies here are pretty easy to kill, thank goodness. Okay, how much damage does Edgar do with the natural hit? means we still need one more fight for Terra then. Also, if we learn Haste and Slow too, any other utility stuff that Edgar can learn? I mean, there's Stop. Hmm. Stop and Cross Zone. Not gonna bother with those. Cure 3. Eh. I don't think I'll really bother. Back to Bismarck. Oh, wait. Oh, no! I just leveled without the... That's too bigger that I just ripped. Man, now I really wish I had the mobile version of FF6 where you can just reload a quick save post battle switch espers.
I'm actually kind of mad about that. Because Palidor didn't have any level bonuses with it as I was... Right... Do I really want to do this all again? I, I am this close to software setting right now. Mm. It's not really worth. Yeah, it'll just. I'll, I'll just save to force myself to move on. It'll plague me, or haunt me in the back of my mind for the rest of the play- other- I mean, we've had like, other inefficient levels across the playthrough, but whatever. <laughs> uh, okay. Still mad though. C Cause the- the two extra vigor! Well, it technically would've been three with Hyper Wrist. I don't think it's that important, but m m min max. I can't live without it. Especially knowing that it was a goof on my part, not necessarily like leveling that I was forced into or whatever. Or, or no, no, no. I was worried that differently, but that will. Actually, let me double check my espers one more time out of paranoia, so. Oh no, we learned, uh. Right, I was about to switch. Oh no, wait. I thought we did learn it. Right, I was about to look for one more, but then I was complaining about forgetting. And this time for sure, no one is next to leveling, regardless of who or what we kill. Okay. And we have still- we still have extra room to cap out on Vigor anyway, since it's not as high of a requirement to cap out on compared to Magic. Cause you can't really cap out on Magic <laughs> in this game. Damage as I thought. Oh no, Gogo's dead. Oh no, he blocked it. The god. Oh, oh come on, what do you get three? Okay, no, they blocked it. Okay, but yeah, I'm, I'm definitely gonna need way more HP to scale, uh, to scale the Atma weapon at this point. So you got a long way to go. Got it. Actually, we can just rest at the old man's place. And then after that, we gotta restart the search for Locke. I forget, like, does the game... Like, the game should drop hints as to where we could find Locke, right?
Alright, so if I was Locke, where... Where would I be? Certainly not Domo Castle. Would be living life in the desert? Certainly not the tower. Is it is it like in a hidden zone or is it like a cave or something I should be looking out for? Because at this point there's really nothing else much here. This is where I found seven. Actually wait, what's uh what's this place? Oh! Wait, we're going in? Wait, we're go- we, we're going in where? Wait! W wait, what did I just sign up for? Um... Um... Wait, ho hold on. Let's go back real quick. Oh, I just put Setzer by himself? Wait, so what is this place? Huh. Anything in this patch of force? Uh, like, this is what I mainly want to check out, but I was wondering about that little open hole there. And don't tell me this is just a chocobo thing. Yeah, I um, should have figured. Can there be a patch of forest that doesn't have a chocobo stable with something actually secret for once? <laughs> Alright, but since we're gonna be doing this, I need to re-equip everyone in the party. Oh wait, actually if I'm gonna equip everyone... Oh boy. Hold on. That means I'm gonna need a... I mean, I already have all the stuff that I'd want on Terra, Celis, Edgar, and Gogo. Now I just need to see who I'd want to equip with other people. Or, on other people. So... I mean, I should probably just make a more balanced group by putting Terra and Celis in both groups. Like, balance wise, that. I mean. Yeah, I'm gonna have to split them. Okay. And besides, uh, Terra already has a uh, dual cast thing, so that's already pretty. pretty stacked. So we'll go with. We'll go with Shadow. Uh, let's go with. Uh, Umaro or Yera. Because, like, the, the main party would be. Uh, Okay, let me just split this up real quick so I can lay out in rows who goes where. So these two would be the leaders. And I think these three would be party two, but then party one... 
Party one. I mean, we have Gogo -Go to imitate or to mimic Terra. So we got magic uh, on lockdown, and he has, he knows all the magic that everyone else knows pulled together. So one more physical damage dealer would suffice, so that would have to be seven. I do feel real bad that uh, I really don't feel like using Strago or Realm though. Alright, I think I'll just decide like or uh, like what I listed above. But now I just need to do a little bit of relic and other bits of cleanup. Oh wait, they said I can switch between groups using squares, so I could play around level ups and stuff, right? Actually, wouldn't, wouldn't Seven be better with the uh, Genji Glo- No, but the the blocks, though. Being able to block is probably preferable. Here we go, Crown. Oh yeah, uh... Now here's where I, where I would want the gauntlet and extra fight damage. I should know, hyper risk would probably be better. Yeah, he ain't gonna block crap though. Then I think I'm gonna need better. Oh no no, I think Crystal Mill is the best that I can get since I don't have a shield. Otherwise, I'd be in the 200 range. Let's see, stunner. Now, should I dual wield with shadow, though? Hmm. Tomorrow, top tier. Oh yeah, yeah, uh, Umaro doesn't equip anything. <laughs> you can equip, uh, relics though. Safety bit. Yeah, sure. Cheapest duty gear up. Yeah. Uh, let's do hero ring because of being able to throw. Uh, hero ring because of blitz. Depending on what we need to do. Hyper risk for damage. I don't think I have enough. Oh no, I do have enough hyper risk. Alright, we'll, we'll just make everyone do crazy amounts of damage. Alright, but I'm pretty sure I still need to update equipment for shadow. And seven. Where's the best shop in the in the world of ruins so far at this point? Oh yeah, I also need to figure out espers and stuff. Hmm. Is it South Figaro? Actually, was it South Figaro? Or is this Nikea? Safigara.
nothing of value here in the weapon shop. Diamond shield? No, that's for people who don't have... Okay. Drago, Realm, Gal, and Amar, the Dream Team. Actually, no, wasn't there a... Maybe I should have looked at it, but wasn't there a town that sold... Crystal Set? I mean, I don't mind if I'm wasting Gil, because uh, now that I know about the Cactar... And the Hoover enemy grinding spot. Gil is no longer an issue in this game. But uh, let's see. Oh, wait, wait. <laughs> God, it, it's a little bit confusing because I, I exit out the left and I. <laughs> you pop out back on the right side. 